Hello guys and welcome to another new game from Pug Gaming. Yes, it's The Walking Dead, the amazing series, and we're going to have a go at the Season 3, A New Frontier. I've played all the others and they've been absolutely amazing and I cannot wait to get my hands into this. I hope you guys will enjoy this series. Obviously there's not going to be as much uh, commentary from myself there's a lot of talk and a lot of gameplay that sort of happens without you needing to hear my voice. But there's obviously stages where we need to make decisions on what we're going to do and choose the path for how the game will portray for us personally. So let's have a go. David, I had to leave my car. It's traffic just it's backed up for miles. He's dead. No, no, I, I, I tried. You're a piece of shit. You know that. One time, just the okay, one so goddamn first time one. that you needed to be here. I think we'll try and play it cool and say we tried. I tried. Please, I tried. Oh, you tried. You fucking tried? Oh. He is not happy. Everyone's here. They've been here for days. And where the fuck were you? <clears throat> we're there, all around him. People who love him, all around him. And he's scared. I'm seeing the panic in his eyes, and he's searching the room. Donde esta Javier? Donde esta mi hijo? I'm there. Right beside him, holding his hand. Like a good son. And he doesn't even see me. He doesn't even see me because he's looking for you. You don't think there's a million places we'd rather be? You don't think we all had to make sacrifices? He was my dad too! Alright? I mean, you're not... You're not the only one dealing with this! And what a fine son you turned out to be. Uncle Javi? Why are you fighting? I can hear you from inside. What's going on? We were just, uh, talking, Gabriel. Right. Your uncle and I are just having a little chat. Go inside, mijo. We'll be in in a minute. Go on. It's okay. Inside. I should call someone, pick up the body. Yeah. I love you, little brother. You know that, right? With everything going on. Well, you got a pretty funny way of showing it. You think I was jealous of you? No, I, I don't think anything. Well, I was. For a long time. You've lost more than I'll ever have. But maybe something good can come out of all this. Because we need you here. It's time to grow up. You can't run from this. Not anymore. 
Sorry. I've got my own life. I'll be here for the funeral. And then I'm gone. Then that's that. Javi. Kate. I'm so sorry, Javi. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Let's go inside. Your mom needs you. What happened? Come on. Mama. Where were you? I tried. I tried. I'm so sorry. He's gone, mijo. He's gone. He's in a better place, Mama. No puedo conectarme. Dicen que no hay servicio. So as expected, an amazing introduction for this new series, and I'm sure it's going to get better. You thirsty, baby? You want some juice? Grandpa's cup was empty. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. People's awake. Oh damn, we know what this means. Where's your sister? <laughs> keys! Where the fuck are the keys? Take Dad's car. Keys are on the dash. <laughs> Mama, get the kids. Meet at the hospital. Don't take the highway. It's blocked. <gasps> I'll bring the van around. Where's Mari? I, I don't know. Mija. Mariana! From the stars! Mariana, we have to go. Yaya's hurt. Come on, honey. We have to go. No, no, no! 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 It's okay. No. It's okay. 
County General Hospital. I know the way. Tell me when it reaches the campfire. I think we should probably get going. We will. I just need to know how fast they're moving. Damn it. I left my water bottle. Her just got there. <sighs> just under four hours. Come on. We should keep moving while the kids are asleep. Yeah. It looks like the herd is speeding up a little. I thought it was drifting southwest, but I'm not sure anymore. Every time I think we should just bed down somewhere and wait for it to pass, I can't shake the thought of us getting caught in the middle of it. It just keeps coming. Okay, so here we want to offer it's a bit so of reassurance and just let her know what we're doing is the right thing by carrying on. We should keep moving. It worked for us so far. As long as we stay supplied, we're fine. Yeah, maybe you're right. The van isn't so bad. We'll figure it out. We always do. Hey. I'm gonna sneak a smoke. I can't believe you found weed. Are you kidding? People were probably growing this before they realized they needed food. So we'll just let her be here and let her have a little smoke. You want me to do that? The last joint you rolled looked like a kazoo. You're driving, and I've come a long way since then. Uh, it was like three days ago. Relax. Mariana's got headphones on and Gabe is drooling. I think we're in the clear. So based on the fact that she's having one, we're uh, going to say no, no for the good of the kids. One of us should be sober. <laughs> Don't judge me. <laughs> oh, when I found out David had kids, I told him... I am not changing who I am around them. <laughs> and when he proposed, I reminded him that I'm not exactly stepmother material. <laughs> Case in point. He was reassuring, but yeah, I could tell he was worried about it. I knew he'd try to get me to change. <laughs> or at least he'd hope that being around the kids more would change me, you know? So again, here we'll offer some reassurance, make her feel a I bit better. We want to build up a good character relationship. If it helps, I think you're doing a fine job. <laughs> Don't be cheesy, alright? I'm not fishing for compliments. Well, you caught one, alright? So, now what? I used to talk shit about all those mothers who'd go on about raising their kids being the hardest thing in the world. Gabe's making me start to think they had a point. <laughs> His mood swings are just... Uh, I don't know. Some days I just want him even by the side of the road. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Jesus. Obviously. You really shouldn't say things like that. I said it was a joke. It's half a joke. It's all joke. Look, I love these kids. But I could do without Gabe reminding me I'm not his mother whenever he's pissed. He's a teenager. Puberty. Hormones. The second you start getting boners, the whole world starts to get dark. What are you talking about? It sounds delightful compared to dealing with bloody underwear. <laughs> Christ. I need to get laid. 
did. <laughs> I realized that was an awkward transition. Sorry about that. You know, the kids can hear you. I just, no one wants to hear their parents talking about that. Stepmoms and uncles don't count. They're asleep. And besides, we're not really their parents. Still. Mm. What's that smell? That's gross. Hey, Mariana. Shouldn't you be, uh, sleeping or something? I already know you guys do drugs. That's a pretty severe way of phrasing it, Mariana. Don't tell Gabe. He's the one who told me. Ugh. Oh my god. You're even smoking in the car now? All right. Everyone roll the windows down before you all get contact high. We're about to make a supply stop. Home alone, Mari? I'm praying I find a candy bar. <laughs> All right. What do we actually need? Uh, a so, whenever I play this game, I want to keep the relationships Please, very Mariana. strong between Not all characters. Want. So, we'll take the side the of her Please, this time. God, let there be candy bars. Amen. Well, let's start with some gas and move up from there. going okay that's cool have fun oh, Jesus it never ends with him I hate when they fight like that I really hate it it's like all Gabe wants to do is argue it doesn't matter what it's about well, that makes two of us but we're stuck with them so at least you have your headphones yeah but the batteries have been dead for a couple of weeks. I mostly wear them to fool you guys. <laughs> you... You sneaky little... <laughs> That's smart. That's pretty smart. Be nice to find some dinner. In a junkyard. You never know. These past four years, people have been hoarding all kinds of shit in all kinds of places. Oh, and Mari, if there's any trouble, you can find one of these cars. Yeah? Lock yourself in and don't come out. Not even once it's quiet. And wait as long as you can. Okay. Good girl. Okay, so it's time to play the game properly. Hey, any luck, kiddo? I need a pen. Or a pencil. Just something to write with. A pen? Why are you looking for that? There's just something I really want, I really need to do. And I need a pen for it. 
Last night I was thinking about this stupid story my mom used to tell me all the time before bed. I used to hate it. But... But then I realized I don't remember the ending. It was this goofy ending she thought was so funny and I thought was so dumb. I want to write down everything I can remember about everything. Because if I forget and they're all gone, I'm kind of gone too. At least a little bit. I just think that might be kind of important. Maybe. That's a great idea, Mariana. So again, we'll give her a bit of confidence and make her feel a bit better about life. Just rotting bits of old rubber and tires. Nothing good left. Someone picked it clean. So we'll have a look around here, see what we can find. Most of the dashboard is torn out, seats are gone. Eh, this thing's dead. Oh, that's gross. Okay, now I'm sorry I did that. You find anything? I can't stop thinking about that herd. We get caught in it, and, and that's it. Peace, asshole. Can't charm your way out of that one. And we'd be gone in seconds. Hey, don't think about that. We're careful. We're smart. We'll stay ahead of them. <sighs> Luck runs out just as easily as gas. There's gonna be a last one, you know? A last tank of gas. Last piece of food. What if this place is empty? And, and the next? And the next... We're not gonna let that happen. Okay? Okay. I let it have its five minutes. I'm good. I wouldn't have minded having one of these back in the day. Come to Papa. Barely anything. I'll need to find more. I don't think these tires would fit the van. What's going on in there, buddy? I'm in a bad mood, okay? I want it to go away, but... you won't. I just wish we weren't always on the road. I like being with other people. It's just... We're in that car so damn long. The AC hasn't worked in ages. And it... It ain't my last damn tape. Well, that's a sweet idea. But it's safer to keep moving. I don't know. Maybe just leave me alone. Okay. But if you want to talk later, I'm... around. This one looks promising. B. 
Ringo. Okay, I can see a ladder. Now this is where things may get interesting. Looks like there's more to see up here. Any luck? Some. But not enough. Gabe? Hey, Gabe. Let's go take a look over there. Gabe, stay close to Javi. Got it? Oh, all right. Look, there's one they never took to pieces. Good catch. <sighs> Shit, it's locked. All right, here goes nothing. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Look at all that fuel. This is going to take a while. Locked. Oh well. At least it had some gas. Looks like it came from in there. Gabe, stay close. Not gonna be able to pry this open. Damn it. <laughs> Looks pretty run down. Might be able to get in through the hatch. Gabe, come check this out. Not the cleanest place. Oh, no muertos, at least. Just be careful.
Are you kidding me? Lucky for you, they put enough preservatives in this stuff to last for centuries. Well, there's enough food in here to keep us going for a long time. Oh, check it out. This is actual honest-to-God pudding! Seriously? And it's not just food. There's a mattress. There's blankets. Someone else's mattress. Someone else's blankets. We need to just take our gas and get on the road. This place does have a funny feeling about it. And if Muertos were to somehow surround us... Great. Now I'm officially creeped out. Come on, one night. We bunk down, eat a real meal. It would be nice not to sleep in the van for a change. Please. The herd is coming, if it's not here already. We should go and get ahead of it, before it's too late. The fence is reinforced. We'll be fine. We found this. Why can't we just enjoy it? Javi, can we? The kids are right. We deserve a little break from the van. Yes! Kids, go wild. Just stay indoors and keep your ears open. <laughs> just in case. Cool. You can have your own. I don't know how I always end up being the mean stepmom, and you get to be the cool uncle. We should be able to switch roles now and then. Keep the kids off balance. Look, it's just a nice break. We get to spend the night with four walls instead of four wheels. And I think we deserve that. Whatever. It's fine. Grab some gas. We're out of here in a few hours. Hey, uh, wait, but you... You're the cool one, remember? She'd expect it from you. What the fuck do you think you're doing with our gas? Go on, speak up! Okay, so we gotta be careful here. We don't know what's gonna happen. I'm sorry, man. Look, it's just a can. We needed it really we? bad. I fucking knew it. There's more than just you out of here. You ain't the loner type. I can tell. I know you got people. Look, don't worry about them. They took off and then they're not coming back. Just up and left you, huh? <laughs> Fan out and look for the others. Lonnie, you're with me. Hey! You assholes in there! I got your boy! You don't want him getting shot, you best come out there careful with your hands up! Go on, you first. You get ambushed by your own people, that shit's gonna make my day. Open it real slowly. had a real face time. You can't just take what you like. I don't roll over like that. Look, we hardly took any. Uh, really, someone must have been here before us. Look, I, I, I get it, all right? You're starving. Who the fuck is it? At the end of your rope, thought you hit pay dirt. Honest mistake. But I got this sneaky fucking feeling... <laughs> You're full of shit. I ain't gonna let it be like the last time some assholes rolled on us. Keep an eye on this dickhead. I'm gonna grab some cuffs. You got it. 
Just chill, okay? No need to make this any harder. Look, your buddy's not thinking straight. So let's talk, okay? You and me, we can get this sorted out. No, it's his call. Look, man, this doesn't have to go. What the fuck was that noise? What you got hiding under there, boy? If you know something, you better spill it. You don't want me finding out for myself. Come on, man, what else? There are muertos down there. There were a bunch of them outside, too. The dead, huh? Well, then, we better take care of that, shouldn't we? So guys, I think that's a perfect spot to end episode one. This game, I believe, is going to get better and better the more we play. I'll be extremely pleased to hear your thoughts on this and whether you want to see more or not, to be honest. Um, yeah, so other than that, thanks for watching and I'll catch you in my next video. All the best.